back. If you're new here, hi, my name is Crystal. I do fashion and lifestyle content several times a week and I'm really glad that you're joining me here today for the very first of the spooky hauls. Ooh, I have a witchy shirt on. So this is the first video I'm filming in my new apartment. Um, and so I do want to say bear with me while I get set up and figured out I don't have like a couch yet and stuff. So we're still waiting for like furniture to arrive. It's a little echoey. I'm not really sure how we're going to do these things going forward. So just bear with me while I figure out the best lighting and situation and stuff. And another thing I'm going to bring up is my hair is looking a little uh, charcoal. Um, the purple has faded out and this is what I have been working with. Not mad at it, but I'm definitely going to be going back to Ali to um, get some more purple put in very soon so this is what we're working with but I actually think fits in really nicely with today's spooky haul now before I get into today's haul I do kind of want to share like just a little story kind of a little story maybe you guys can relate to it let me know if you can um, one of the things that have oh, that's always been such a huge struggle for me being plus size was finding Halloween costumes and Halloween like stuff um, I love Halloween I love going to Halloween parties I try to go to some every year and the options when you're plus size are like not like non-existent um, and as the years have progressed things have gotten better but I think one of the things that always made me feel really kind of crappy this time of year while being plus size is that I can never really get the cute costumes and I can never really get like the cute stuff to be adorable at Halloween like everyone else so um, the main reason why I'm talking about that is because this is the first of a couple of hauls that are going to be Halloween focused because I'm sure you guys struggle as much as I do this time of year trying to find a fun costume trying to find something different now I will say that still to this day in this day and age in this economy um, in 2017 it's still really really challenging to find Halloween costumes so um, it's not great but it's getting there and so today's spooky haul um, is some stuff from boohoo that is Halloween themed so I'm gonna call this haul the haul for girls who like Halloween but don't want to wear costumes but look really cute and stuff how about that? That's gonna be it. So um, I'm just gonna go ahead and dive right in. I haven't filmed the try-on portion of this haul and I literally have no idea where I'm gonna do it in this place, but we'll, you know, we'll get there, we'll get there. I did try all this stuff on though. So the first thing I wanna show you guys, I have everything from like t-shirts to bodysuits to like dresses. It's, it's kinda cute. I think it's, everything's real cute. So the first one I have to show you, you know Boohoo, it's a little sassy. So it's this bodysuit. It's a long sleeve back bodysuit with um, hands on the tatas. I feel like this is a little, little sass mouthy but it is really cute it's made with that boohoo t-shirt material so the bodysuits are always really comfortable to wear but i just thought that was really fun like really funny like i think if you're you know an adult and you're going to a halloween party or something and you don't want to wear like a costume but you want to be festive this is such a great little option so that was a fun find um all my sizes and everything by the way will be listed um down below in the description box um because i could get kind of sizes all over the board but i really really did like that the next item I have, oh, this is really exciting, but this kind of upset me a little bit. So it's a, it's a, look at that. First of all, look at that print. Like how cute is that print? I just love it. It's like vampire teeth and stuff. So it's a long sleeve midi length dress. I love this. The one thing that really mm, upset me was that when I got it, I'm going to try and find it so I can show you guys on camera. There's a huge hole in it like a huge hole in it here yeah like a, like this is mid thigh so there's a huge hole in it now in the tram portion i'll be wearing um black spanks with it so you won't see it but there's a huge hole kind of on the seam that kind of bugs me that really upsets me you know when you buy something and it comes with a huge hole in it now thankfully it's on the seam so it's going to be a really quick easy stitch and with boohoo the stuff is so affordable that like i very rarely will like take the effort to just send it back. If it doesn't work for me, I give it away, I donate it. Um, with something like this that I actually want to wear, I'm going to um, just stitch it up myself. But I just really like the print on this. Um, the blood, I don't know if you guys can see, there's like a little teeny bit of glitter in there. So it's just a, li it's a little glam, but I really, really like this. It's such a shame that there's a hole in it. Um, you know, such as life with, with Boohoo and their $10 dresses. Okay, the next thing I have to show is a t-shirt. It's kind of along the vibe of the first um, little bodysuit that I showed. It's a little more <laughs> sass mouthy because it kind of looks like the hands are kind of giving you the okay sign or they're doing something else that adults would know about. <laughs> um, but this is really cute. It's an oversized, very soft black t-shirt. I think this is going to be really cute if you want to wear this with like a leather jacket and some jeans or something. Again, festive. A little a little suggestive but you know still very very cute 
I have a two piece to show you guys. This one, okay, so this one, I did try all this stuff on before, and this one was, um, the shirt was a little too big for me, but the bottoms fit really cute. So conceptually, it's like a, an undead mermaid. So this is the skirt, and it's kind of got like the fish bone, like fin kind of print on it, and then the top has shells, which is real cute, like really cute. So I like the concept of them together. Um, the shirt was just like a little too big for me. I forget what size I got this in. What size did I get this in? Probably got this in an 18. Um, yeah, I got this in an 18, so the top is too big. The skirt fits really, really nicely. Again, everything is made of a very, very soft t-shirt material, so you're not gonna get a lot of longevity out of this stuff, but for the price of it, you'll definitely get through the Halloween season looking real cute and festive. I could see someone who's really good at makeup doing like an undead aerial kind of vibe with this, so um, I, might, I might do a video with that. That would be kind of fun. The next item I have to show you guys is another bodysuit. This one, again, is skeletal, but it has more of a full kind of torso that goes all the way down to the hip um, as you snap it, and then it also has the bones on the arms. I thought that was really fun. Dem bones, dem bones. It reminds me of, like, Kelly and Toby um, from The Office on Halloween when they wore, like, the the glow-in-the-dark skeleton. That was like one of my favorite episodes, by the way, of The Office. I love The Office. Does anybody else love The Office? You gotta like give me a thumbs up. Thumbs up for everybody who likes The Office, because The Office is like the best show ever. And the last fashion item I have to show for you guys, this is really adorable as well. They do, they're doing a lot of the bones kind of stuff. So this is a bodycon, but a knee length right above the knee length bodycon. It's an off the shoulder, so it's got the torso, it's got the hip bone, a little bit of leg bone at the bottom, and then it's got bones on the arm. Again, just really fun, really cute, super light. Um, and I think I would wear this if I had like a, you know, like a little party to go to and I didn't have a costume. Um, I would definitely wear this. Also, it's just really easy to wear around and super, super seasonal. I do have a couple of little accessories on the vein of girls who want to participate in Halloween but don't want to wear a costume but still want to look cute. Um, the first is this blood Halloween choker. I mean, I'm gonna like just show you guys. So this is what it looks like, and it literally is like, I think, I'm assuming I haven't taken it out yet. It's like jelly feeling. It's kind of funny. Um, it has, it's pretty good length, it's a little stretchy. It feels like very gummy, like super gummy, and it's kind of like, is sticking to the package. But basically, if you wanted to do just a little something, something Halloween-y, mm-hmm, pretty fun, right? I kind of like it. It looks like my head is severed. And the other two little things I got are little headbands. The first one I got a little devil. Again, sometimes you just want to wear all black and then be like mildly festive, you know? Or if you're not even really into Halloween but you have to go to a party, you're like, look, now we're festive. Ta da! I love little devil ears. Um, I did a series of photos last year with Fashion to Figure that was all like, holiday or I'm sorry Halloween costumes with like minor accessories using their dresses and I used a pair of devil ears to go with the red dress and it was really really fun so you can't go wrong with these but imagine like if you especially if you're going to work on Halloween because I think Halloween falls on a Tuesday this year you can totally get away with wearing these at your desk and like you're good to go and the last ooh, what happened here there we go hair is a little out of control today the last little thing I have to show you guys I have to figure out how I'm going to use these because like the cutest thing in the world. We got a little unicorn. I'm gonna dip way down. Got a little unicorn. Kinda looks like poop. That horn looks like poop, I'm not gonna lie. It's not the most flattering unicorn horn in the world, but if you wanna be a little unicorn, that's still really cute. Okay guys, so that is it for me and this first spooky Halloween haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it half as much as I enjoyed putting it together for you and you saw something that you like. Let me know if Halloween costumes is something that you guys are looking for. Are you already looking? Halloween is literally 30 days away. We don't have a lot of time to find some really good costumes, so let me know what you guys are doing for Halloween and what do you want to be for Halloween? I'm super curious. Or are you going to wear something like this and be festive but not get dressed up? So don't forget to leave me a comment down below and give me your Halloween scoop and give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I love you guys so much. I'll see you next time. Bye! Ooh, spooky. Okay guys, so if you liked this haul but you're looking for some real clothes, you can check out this one and this one right here. These are just normal, regular hauls because maybe you're not looking for Halloween stuff just yet. Don't forget to hit subscribe. It's right there. 
haul subscribe